you! Hello, I'd like to draw your attention to the equipment displayed in front of you. For those who do not know, this equipment is standard issue for the M1919A4. What is the M1919A4, some of you may ask? Well, commonly referred to as just the 1919. The 1919 is a 30 caliber belt-fed light machine gun used heavily during the Second World War by U.S. ground forces. Hello, I'm Staff Sergeant Meyer with 2nd Armored Division Reenacted, and assisting me today is Private Decker. We will be explaining some of the basic gear issued with the M1919A4. To cover the M1919A4 briefly, the M1919A4 is again a 30 caliber air-cooled light belt fed machine gun. Fed by cloth or steel links from an M1 ammunition can. The M1 ammunition can holds 250 30 caliber rounds and can be stored or carried in the M1 ammunition bag. The 1919A4 has a fire rate of about 500 rounds a minute. At 500 rounds a minute, the barrel can get exceedingly hot relatively quickly. Therefore, they issued spare barrels in the M9 spare barrel bag. One of these were issued with each gun to be changed as necessary. On the opposite side of the gun, we have the M5 tool chest, which carried all the tools and parts necessary to keep the 1919 alive in a combat situation. The 1919 is crewed by a two-man crew. Myself, the gunner, carries the tripod and an ammunition can. During combat, I fire the weapon. The, to the left of me, Private Decker, my assistant, he carries the gun and an additional ammunition can while maneuvering, and it helps feed the gun during combat. To display some of the gear we have on me, the gunner and occasionally assistant was issued an M1911A1 pistol in 45 caliber. These were used in self-defense when the 1919 is deemed unnecessary. Some of the other gear we carry, as Private Decker will show, we have our M36 pistol belts. Attached to that is the M1919 canteen set. Opposite to that, the M42 first aid pouch. And holding all of that up, the M36 suspenders. Other than that, all the equipment and uniform is of that of a basic U.S. rifleman during World War II. That covers some of the basic gear issued to the 1919 and its crew. Thank you for watching.